Okay, so I've been watching these videos on mycology. I think that's what it's called, the study of mushrooms. And if you speak Russian, I'm going to put these lectures down below because they're brilliant. And I think everyone should watch and learn more about mushrooms. And um, the person who makes these videos, he's a professional, so he's not going to talk about shrooms he's going to talk about actual mushrooms so and as I was listening to this one lecture about the possible time of when mushrooms came to be and about how ancient they are and how now they get a kingdom of their own because they're so unique and so cool and I was just looking at all of these examples of symbiotic or symbiotic existence that mushrooms have um, taken part in and I was so amazed and astounded by the fact that mushrooms can cohabit and live symbiotically with pretty much everyone who is alive including humans and I'm not talking about the mushrooms that we eat uh, we do contain um, a microbiome which consists of bacteria fungi and viruses as well as far as I know and fungi may play a bigger role in our lives than we imagine so that is fascinating to me and I want to learn more about how I am a mushroom person actually and everyone as well one example of mushrooms playing a crucial role in the microbiome of animals is the formation of cow's milk so this professor shared that uh, cow's milk wouldn't be possible without this little fungi obviously I don't remember the name but you just have to take my word for it or watch that lecture in Russian so <laughs> you can't question us but I was uh, so astounded to learn that um, they are vital mushrooms and fungi fungi are vital to the existence of many animals and I have my run with some fungal um, strains or whatever they're called uh, Malassezia I think is commonly known to those who've got atopic dermatitis myself included so this may be an organism that can influence you negatively but I think I found a way to coexist with this particular fungi so now I'm no longer afraid of being a home to the mushrooms because I understand that without them I wouldn't be alive and I do remember this little uh, Kurzgesagt I think video about microbiome and how if we take away all of the bacteria that's in us we're gonna die because we cannot digest much of our food without uh, our microbiome the bacteria is incredibly important in the in many many processes of our digestive system and it's just basically we are a symbiotic or symbiotic organism together with all these bacteria and fungi some people say fungi uh, and to me this is such a huge argument for mutual aid it's like we depend on all of these microorganisms we cannot live without them yet somehow we don't want to keep on practicing mutual aid in other areas of our life and my question is why like don't we see all the interdependencies of the universe and don't we want to be one with the universe once again I highly recommend you learn more about mushrooms and symbiotic or symbiotic living and see that everything in nature is based on cooperation, not competitiveness.